Hi guys, George here from Team Ninjas. In this video we're going to run through the operation or the basic operation of the new Team Ninjas marketing system which is called the Ninja Team Builder. This should have been released a month ago but um, it turned into being a reasonably large undertaking. Basically we've had it built, custom built from scratch. So um, it's going to be pretty cool and we are now officially live so that's pretty cool. So within the system there's going to be two different uh, levels. You can see down here so people within the ninjas team uh, will get it, the builder version for free which will have basically everything you need to market your business and also for the e-commerce side as well. So it's useful for both affiliates and for uh, people that solely want to do the e-commerce or customers of Infinii per se and soon we will release the pro version which will just have a lot more added on bits and pieces for people that want to take it to the next level and play around with it a bit more uh, you don't need that to be successful but there you know people always want to play around there's always some people that do so we will offer that as well and that will have a small monthly fee uh, we haven't determined what the cost will be yet as we're still putting it together so we've got to work out what our costs are going to be but it won't be much um, also, we're going to offer it to people not within the Ninjas team. Uh, the reason we're going to do that is because the more people we have using it, the more income it can create, even if it's only a little bit. It will go towards creating, um, upgrading it, new resources, and making it better for everybody, basically. More training in that we can put in there. Uh, we can hire some other professionals from outside to come in and help. So it's basically it's just an added bonus to everybody, really. And you know, the more success that Infinii creates, the better it is for all of us. So within people that are not in the Ninjas team, the Builder version will not be free. They will have a small monthly fee. And then the Pro version will just have a slightly higher monthly fee than what the people within the Ninjas team will have. But either way, it's going to be pretty cheap for everybody and hopefully apply, um, provide a lot of value. So here you can see that the URL is Ninja, N-I-N-J-A, TB stands for teambuilder.com. So to create your account, simply type that into your browser and you'll come to this page here where you will create your account. Now if you've already created one, you'll simply click on login up the top here. We'll run through the whole scenario of creating one. So into your first name, last name, your email, your country and your time zone. Now make sure you enter this accurately because it will translate all of the company announcements, uh, webinars, upcoming events etc into your own time zone. So it takes a lot of that hassle out for you and makes things simple and we like simple of course. Uh, postcode your phone number in there, click continue. And now it's asking for your Infinii username. Now, very important that that is your actual Infinii username. It's got to be exactly the same. If you don't enter this correctly, uh, your links in that will not work. So make sure you do this right. Create a password. Now you've got to have uh, between six and eight characters and at least one number. And click submit. Now registration completed successfully. Click here to access your members area. Make sure you remember your username and password that you had on there. And you can either use your username or your email address that you entered before when you created the account and then simply click log in. So this is your back office. Now we've tried to make it as simple as possible. We don't want to confuse people. We want it to be simple because really a lot of it is simple. It's just replication and doing a few steps over and over each day and you will create success. There's a, you know, a Marketing online is massive and there's so many different things to learn and you can go off on different tangents but uh, really just focus on a few things, keep doing it and you will do well. Simple is better. So in here we've got um, marketing funnel which is on the left here, the information there, then we've got lead manager which you can see the information's here, uh, communication manager which is down here in regards to emails, then we've got a resources tab and a support tab. Also up the top we've got your email envelope here which takes you to your email account, a uh, calendar for notifications and alerts. So you'll notice when there's a little red tick up here it means that there's a new alert in there that you haven't read so if you have a look here, say we are live, we can click on that and we'll see what sort of alert we've got and say we are live, finally we are live. Welcome to a new Infinio marketing system. For more information use the uh, team builder system 
and check this video out below. At the moment we've got a lady doing braids but we'll put this video that we're doing right now in here very soon. So to um, over here also you've got your profile so if you click on there first thing you need to do is make sure all of this information is accurate if you need to change it at all um, come in here and do so. And you can also add in your website, your Skype ID and your Facebook link to your profile. So for Facebook in particular make sure you put in your full link which will be http colon forward slash facebook not boob <laughs> dot com forward slash and then whatever your profile ID is so when you're in Facebook click on your profile copy the link paste it in there uh, Skype so this would be just your individual Skype name which and your website once again put in the HTTP and whatever your website is and click Save uh, you can also up to upload a profile picture okay and then go, to go back to the home page either click on the little house here or just click on the logo uh, to the left here I'll take you back to the home page. So first thing over here we've got the marketing funnel so this is your personal uh, marketing URL which is simply uh, www.ninjatv.com forward slash and your username if you click on that it'll open in a new link and this is just a simple capture page here with a two minute video there from John Kinnear and your capture form name and email let me in. So you can send that out as is right now and anyone that falls in that form will come into your contact manager, your lead manager over here. Now for most marketing, we suggest that you break it up into and create different URLs so that you can track and test your marketing. So although you can just send out this link here, you have got a few other options here as well. Uh, this one here, invite new lead, comes down and you can invite them by email, it's the only one we've got set up at the moment. So you can type in the person's name, uh, Harry, and Harry's email is harry at harry.com um, phone number if you've got it and the group name where you want them to go uh, Ninja Leads is the default one but we can create some more um, if you like and we can show you how to do that in a minute now select your redirect URL so we've got two different options here at the moment um, in Infineo when you go to your back office in there you'll see that there is some options for some links now this one here is the page that takes you directly to your join page where there's a video that um, Kevin Hokuana did it's about uh, 10 to 20 minutes going through the program which is pretty good and there's a button below where they click to join and it, they sign up from there so you can have either that one or the one below it is the full presentation webinar um, which gets updated you know pretty regularly and that's like a 40 minute full overview of the system so wherever you want them to go after they've filled out the form on your page so so either way they're going to get a sent a link which is going to go to this page and then they fill out the form and when they fill out the form they click let me in and from there it redirects to one of these two options whichever one you select we will have the live register webinar and option in there as well but at the moment they're having a few issues with that so we've excluded it until they get that sorted um, now you can also add their country um, this person's in Austria and their time zone in there more for your reference I guess and then click generate invite and it comes in here you got a subject line and a template email written there for you with your click here join link to find out more and that will take them to that capture page and when they click let me in it'll go to whichever one of those redirects you put in. Now you can edit this email as much as you like just simply type in and use the text editor here to change a bit of the formatting. Pretty simple and then click send invite and it will send that invitation off to Harry. As soon as you do that it also adds them into your contact manager immediately. So the other option is create a unique URL. This is what we'll be doing more often than the email version personally. Now any type of marketing you do you want to create a unique URL so you can track whatever um, the progress of that particular marketing effort. It doesn't matter whether it's paid or free you still need to know what's working um, because basically free is still costing your time and that's pretty valuable so there's no point in doing something that's not very effective. So you work out what's working and add to that basically. 
So click on there, create a new unique URL, come down here and it says intended location of unique marketing URL. Now this is more for your reference, so you can track it. So say we're going to do some, use this for posting in Facebook groups. So we'll say face groups, go continue, group name, once again we've got the default one in here. Uh, select the URL we want to go to, um, 9 times out of 10 you want to go to this first one here. Create a title for this URL, so we could type in um, join Infinii today, a short description, so just for your reference once again, so um, going to place, I don't know, 5 posts a day in Facebook groups. Ad content, so if it was a particular ad that you're posting somewhere and you've got some text that's going to go on the ad as well with the link, uh, you could post that in there for your reference or you can just leave it blank and then click create your unique URL. Here's the one that you just created here. So join Finio as the title and the code. You see that the system is created for you uniquely. And every time somebody does this, it creates a new one for them. Uh, to the link here. So if we copy that, clicking on there and we paste it up here, you'll see it's ninjatv.com. Instead of your username on the end, it's got uh, this crazy code, but it's the same thing and it is tied to you. When they fill out this form, they'll get redirected to the uh, redirection link that we selected. So pretty simple and if you're going to do some marketing say on on Twitter well then you'd put a new one and create a new uh, unique URL for that or if you're going to run some paid advertising for solo ads or you're going to do some through some other traffic source just create a new one of these each time so then you can, can track the results down here. So we just viewed this one here so if we refresh when we click on here on the view stats now we have one click on there as well one on each. Now for that form if we fill it out whatever you do with any of these systems always test them yourself before you go sending any paid advertising so simply enter a name and an email address that you own and check that the redirection is working correctly and the emails are coming through and all of that so you can see this is the go going to that uh, 10 minute video from uh, Kevin and then when you click on there to get started it'll go through to join and then you'll see your username up the top. Make sure this is correct. If it's not, um, you're going to be sending traffic to the wrong place. If it says root 1 or root 2, uh, that's the company default one, which means there's a problem. So if you're having trouble with that, send us a support ticket and we will sort it out. Uh, so you can see that it's working and if we refresh here, you should see another lead in here. Harry is the one that we did by sending that email invite out. But you can see now we've got this guy George come in there and if we look at the details under that you'll see it's under the group name um, and there's two in that group. If we click on here we can see all leads and you'll see the time date that came in, the browser that that person was using, their IP address, the location. Now that gets run um, I think every hour we've got it set at the moment um, just to not overload the system too much on the API because it will draw quite a lot. Uh, they're running Windows 7 and the screen resolution so it's kind of interesting to know this so you know who you're targeting um, whether it's mobile users or or not. Uh, you can move them to different groups so as we create new groups we can shift them around uh, you can see the actions and you can delete them. So pretty basic there once again so under here view all leads and groups we can add a group so if we want to create another group and we could say Maybe you're going to do a lot of uh, work on Facebook and you want to segregate them into a different group. Well, Facebook, if I could spell, and simply click add. So now we have got two groups. Okay, so that's all pretty simple. So on the left here, you've got your marketing funnel and your links. And if you click on the stats, that will show the different links you've got and the, uh, the total clicks going into those particular uh, links doesn't give you the details on the leads that's under the lead manager system so if you come onto here view all leads it'll show them into groups to start off of so we've got two leads in this ninja group at the moment uh, but if you click on all leads it will show you all of the leads in there and it'll give you further data on your leads um, which is all valuable information for your marketing purposes so over the third one over here, Mark, our communication manager, we've got email, broadcast and autoresponders. So if we click at the autoresponders, within this marketing system you can view the autoresponders but you can't edit them. 
that will be in the uh, pro version for people that want to do that but really you don't need to they're getting run uh, written by copywriters and they're getting updated as the company progresses so you really don't need to play with them at the moment you can see there's only two in there there's this one here that gets sent out instantly and this one here gets sent out on day two the other uh, six or seven will be loaded in there soon Aaron's working on that as we speak I believe uh, so to view them click on the uh, little eyeball there and they'll pop up and here you'll see that it says hi name in the square brackets that's just a variable so it's not going to pull that information when you're looking at it through this uh, portal and it's got the information down there but like I said before make sure you test this yourself so click on your marketing URL fill out the form with your own email so you can see the emails that are coming through and make sure it's all right so that's the autoresponders as I say more will be coming in here then we've got email broadcast which is just a, a simple way of sending out an email to all the contacts in your system in your contact manager or your lead manager so to add a broadcast click on there uh, select the group so these are the the different groups that you've got in there the ninja leads was the default one uh, but we created this extra one here Facebook there are no leads in this group in particular so we can't email them which makes sense so one example could be to create a new group for uh, paid members in your team and then you would shift your leads from one group to another into the paid version once they've upgraded and then you can send different emails to them so you could send a broadcast one out saying hey we're going to have a team webinar or something or you could send out a more marketing one that you've come up with to send to the people that haven't upgraded for example so it gives you those options uh, don't spam people daily don't you know send out ridiculous stuff all day every day because it will reduce the open rate on the overall system which will affect every so that's the three main parts there communication manager then we've got resources now in here so we've got it into two main sections at the moment we've got affiliate information we've also got e-commerce information so this marketing system as we said right at the start is not just for people that want to market the Infinii business it's also going to be here as a tool to help you with your e-com uh, business as well for people that are just interested in the e-commerce or customer portal type thing so uh, you can see two different segregations right at the start main categories so under affiliates we've got partner URLs redirects and branding the information on that uh, we've got banners we've got logos and we've got um, compensation plan information on that so if we have a look at that one you can see we've got the company uh, PDF sitting in there so you can view it or you can download it and we've got a video here which is um, Ken Augustin running over the comp plan which is about 20 or 30 minutes I think so if you click on view it'll pop up there on a video that you can view and load up to full screen if you need be so yeah there's a bunch of banners in there which once again you can view or download if you view them it will not it distorts them because it just pulls it all into that same size that one doesn't look so bad but if we looked at if we look at this one here for example you can see it's distorted it it's not actually what the uh, banner looks like it's just this viewer the way it's showing them so lots more information is going to be loaded into here over the next few days we've got a lot more stuff coming in and it will continually be updated refreshed and improved upon by us and some of our many great leaders with, within the team uh, the last one over here we've got support so if you've got any problems with it uh, send in a support ticket Pretty simple stuff open a new ticket we haven't got any topics set there at the moment but uh, just support type in what it is the problem you're having type your message uh, if you need to upload a file click submit and um, someone will get back to you pretty soon now up here we've got your emailer so you can see the system when you created your account it's also created a email for you an email account so this one here is the username at ninjatv.com so anyone that replies to any of the messages in your autoresponder, which people will, or you hope they will, as their interest um, grows, uh, they'll come into here, into your inbox, and you simply can click on reply to them here and send them an email back, or you can compose, send a new one to whoever, you can follow it and send them into trash. Um, next one across here, we've got the calendar. Now in here, it'll be updated with upcoming events. You can see down here we've got, so today it's the 30th, and this is uh, updated to your own personal time zone which you did when you set up your account or updated your profile here 
So on the 31st for us here in um, Brisbane, Australia, the Saturday call is on at 3 a.m. for us, which is <laughs> pretty unexciting. It's uh, 12 p.m. I think it is Eastern Standard, which is you know not so bad for people over there, but um, not very attractive for us. But anyway, so 3 a.m. and here is the link which is also in your back office in Vineo, but it's also here as well, so you can just copy that, paste it into your browser and register when you need to. And you can see the next one is on at 1 p.m., which is the, uh, that's the corporate update webinar, which you want to make sure you get on that one in particular. There's going to be a lot of cool updates there. And of course, the Saturday partner training will be great as well. So we've got another two in here, which is the presentation webinars the company's doing. So it's every Tuesday and Thursday at, um, in our time zone, it's 1 p.m. And it's 10 p.m. Eastern Standard. Once again, the links are there. So pretty simple, any team webinars and that, we'll have them in here as well. And you can select today, week, whatever you want to do there. The last one was those alerts which we went through there at the start and as I said we got this video on braids at the moment which is um, pretty tricky I've got three little girls and I have a lot of trouble with the hair but um, we will replace this video with the video we're doing right now so any questions let us know uh, support ticket Facebook group email Skype call however you want to do it um, hope this helps uh, the system has got a lot more work coming to it there's going to be um, an option in here to where well, you can buy leads. We're going to run some co-ops as well for some marketing people that we've worked with in the past that have been very good. Uh, so we have some options in here where you can purchase them through here. You'll also be able to purchase them and then transfer them to other people, other usernames within the system. So for example, people in your team, uh, you might run a competition with them and say, you know, whoever's doing this or that, we're going to give you an extra, I don't know, 100 leads or something. So you can then purchase them yourself and then transfer them to people in your team and help them grow. Um, other stuff we'll be looking at doing will be a, a product co-op where we're going to be sourcing some products uh, from some manufacturers, mostly in China, and our people will be able to purchase them from us through there and then sell them in their own eBay, Amazon type accounts. So lots more to come in here, but in the meantime it's up and running. Um, we are starting to drive a lot of traffic in there at the moment through a couple of different systems and we should see a lot more growth uh, within the company going forward now, particularly with the new rollouts from Infinii as well. Things are looking very, very good. So that's it. Uh, enjoy the rest of your weekend. It is now 10 o'clock on Saturday night, so I think it's time for a beer for me. So thank you and talk soon. Cheers.